A Bakersfield family hoping for closure more than two years after their loved one went missing. Authorities say they think they've found the body of Jacqueline Greider in Idaho. And 23 ABC's Laura Acevedo spoke to the woman's stepson about these new developments. Joins us live now in studio with his reaction. Laura. Yeah, Jackie and Brandon, officials say they are confident the body found is Jacqueline Greider. Greider was a Bakersfield native, but spent her summers at their family home in Idaho. Her stepson says they wondered what happened to her since June of 2015. After almost two years. Now we've got an answer of what did happen or where she went. Some relief for a family that's been wondering what happened to Jacqueline Greider in June of 2015. We haven't known how to process that for almost two years. Her stepson, Buzz Greider, got the call this morning. Sheriff's deputies in Idaho told him they found a body. A citizen up there had moved into the area where they found her and built a home and was out walking his dog Sunday morning and came upon uh, what they believed to be her remains. Jacqueline was married to Buzz's father for more than 45 years. He knows her as Jackie. She was always happy, very uh, just uh, enjoyed life. A life she found a way to enjoy despite suffering early stages of dementia. Buzz says she had good days and bad days. She'd remember, oh yeah, we came here and we drive there and we're going there. And and then other days she'd just kind of sit there and be real quiet at a family dinner or something and we'd wondered if she even knew who she was eating dinner with that night. Sheriff's deputies told Buzz they did not suspect foul play. She was found just a mile away from the home she shared with her husband. She liked getting away. She loved, she was an avid walker. So she would walk every day, possibly wandered off and dehydrated. At the time of her disappearance, the area had been searched, but nothing was ever found. Jackie's husband did not want to speak on camera. Buzz tells us his dad's been lonely, but continues to go to Idaho for the summers. He's doing as well as you can be when you don't know where your wife's been for two years. Now we know. Now the family waits for a positive ID and the end to a years-long search. We finally got some resolve. You know what I mean? Because we've been wondering all these years. Officials are working to confirm if the body found is in fact Jackie, but again, they don't suspect foul play. The family thinks because of her dementia, she may have wandered off into the woods and possibly died from dehydration. In studio, Laura Acevedo, 23 ABC.